Scouts Canada is a Canadian scouting association providing programs for young people, male and female, aged 5 to 26, with the stated aim to help develop well-rounded youth better prepared for success in the world. Scouts Canada, in affiliation with the French language association Des Scouts du Canada, is a member of the World Organization of the Scout Movement. In its 2013-14 annual report, it claimed membership figures of 66,741 youth and 21,437 adults a significant decline from its 1965 peak of 288,084 youth and 33,524 adults. Values Scouts Canada's programs are based on three principles duty to God, duty to others, duty to self. Scouts Canada's programs are co-educational and it states it is committed to diversity. Scouts Canada has a policy not to discriminate for reasons of gender, culture, religious belief or sexual orientation. Although Scouts Canada's principles requires a basic spiritual belief, it states that members are not required to subscribe to a religion or belief in God. History For the history of Boy Scouts, Scouting and the Scout Movement in Canada before the formation of Scouts Canada see Scouting in Canada. Scouts Canada acknowledges there is evidence that a few scouting groups started up in Canada in 1907, before Robert Baden-Powell's book, Scouting for Boys was published in England in 1908. Boy Scouts and the Scout Movement were well established across Canada before Scouts Canada or its parent organization. The Boy Scouts Association of the United Kingdom were formed. In 1910, the Boy Scouts Association was formed in the United Kingdom and its founder, Baden Powell, wrote to the Governor General of Canada, Earl Grey, and asked him to organize scouting in Canada. In 1914, a branch council of the Boy Scouts Association was established in Canada under the Boy Scouts Association's Overseas Department. The Canadian General Council of the Boy Scouts Association was incorporated by an act of the Canadian Parliament on 12 June 1914. The Canadian General Council continued to be represented internationally by the Boy Scouts Association of the United Kingdom until 30 October 1946, when the Canadian General Council became a direct member of the Boy Scout World Conference, now the World Organization of the Scout Movement. The organization continues to be a branch of the Scout Association of the United Kingdom. The Canadian General Council of the Boy Scouts Association changed its name to Boy Scouts of Canada by an amendment to its incorporating active parliament. In 1976 the Scouts Canada logo was introduced and the organization, by its bylaws, adopted the name Scouts Canada. In 2007 the Boy Scouts of Canada legally changed its name to Scouts Canada. In 1972, Scouts Canada began accepting female participants as part of its Rover section. This was expanded in 1984 to include the Ventura section. In 1992, co-ed scouting was an option for all program sections and became policy for all sections in 1998. Organizational Structure Scouts Canada is governed by a board of governors. Administration of the organization is divided into 20 councils, each administering a whole province or large part thereof. Each council is headed by a council commissioner appointed by the national commissioner, and a council youth commissioner appointed by the national youth commissioner. Council commissioners furthermore appoint their management teams to manage the interests of the council. All positions are advertised publicly and a selection committee interviews personnel based on skill set. Councils are subdivided into areas, each headed by an area commissioner appointed by the council commissioner, and an area youth commissioner appointed by the council youth commissioner. Scouts Canada is affiliated with Association des Scouts du Canada. Under the World Organization of the Scout Movement's constitution, only one organization is recognized in each country. 
Canada is the only country in which this recognition is held jointly. Many other countries also have more than one scouting organization and some of these have formed national federations which are the WOSM members. Scouts Canada and l'Association des Scouts du Canada send a joint delegation to meetings of the World Organization of the Scout Movement. This is coordinated through the Committee on Cooperation. David Johnston, the current Governor-General of Canada, is the patron scout of Scouts Canada. From 1910 to 2013, the Governor-General of Canada was either the Chief Scout for Canada or Chief Scout of Canada. On 19 April 2013, the Scouts Canada Board of Governors appointed Terry Grant as Chief Scout of Canada. Programs Full-time programs Scouts Canada offers five full-time programs, which it states are open to males and females. Beaver Scouts Beaver Scouts is a scouting program aimed at children between ages 5 to 7. The Beaver Scout uniform includes a bucket hat, a neckerchief, a neckerchief slide, and a vest. Activities include crafts, games, sports, music, hikes, and camping. Spiritual fellowship is also an activity in the program. Cub Scouts The Cub Scout program is a program intended for 8- to 10-year-old children. Activities of the program include hiking, camping, and what the organization refers to as water activities, such as canoeing and kayaking. The program states that its purpose is to encourage members to try new and more challenging activities. Its motto is, Do Your Best. Scouts The Scouting Program of Scouts Canada is a program aimed at children between 11 to 14 years old. Activities include outdoor activities, camping, and hiking, as well as participation in youth forums. It claims that its purpose is having fun while gaining value leadership skills and self-confidence. Venturer Scouts The Venturer Scout program is a program intended for teens between 14 to 17 years old, with a stated aim to offer exciting, real-life, hands-on experiences for youth. Its activities include hiking, camping, and training programs. Rover Scouts Rover Scouts is the final youth stage of scouting, aimed at teens and young adults between 18 to 26 years old. Activities include what the organization describes as adventurous activities and helping in local communities. Vocational programs Medical Venturers Medical Rovers is a new program that consists of venturers and rovers that learn and provide first aid. Medical Venturers have been credited with saving lives in Toronto by using an AED to assist a patient in cardiac arrest. Fire Venturers learn basic firefighting skills while working with fire departments. Police venturers learn firearm safety, crowd control, and similar skills while working with police departments. Part-time programs Scouts Canada also has programs designated as part-time programs. Scouts Abroad Scouts Abroad is a program which was created to support the Canadian Brotherhood Fund. Scouts in wealthier countries like Canada help scouts in developing countries help themselves on the road to self-sufficiency. The Canadian Brotherhood Fund provides through grants, seed money, for many community development projects. Groups of scouts in developing countries develop and carry out projects to improve their own lives and the future of their communities. In some cases, members of Scouts Canada participate in traveling abroad to assist in carrying out portions of a project. Scouts About The Scouts About program aims to fulfill scouting's mission with those children who are not members of a scouting organization. Scouts About is implemented in three-month-long modules, often after school, to appeal to those families who do not want or cannot commit to year-round activities. Theme-based The focus is on structured play and learning by doing without uniforms, badge programs and ceremonies. Scouts About is for children between 5 and 10 years old. Extreme Adventure Extreme Adventure offers the opportunity for young people aged from 14 to 17 to plan and participate in a variety of short-term adventure-based activities. Example activities are hiking, long-term camping and traveling abroad to participate in humanitarian projects.
The program seeks to realize scouting's mission with non-members. There is no uniform and are no ceremonies associated with this program. It is designed to include development of leadership skills and self-esteem and the participation in community projects that is also offered through the ordinary programs. Extreme Adventure is based on the Ventura Amory Adventure Award concept. Major Youth Awards Scouts Canada has several major youth awards which include the Chief Scouts Award was established in 1973 as the top award in the Scout section. The Queen's Venturer Award is the top award in the Venturer section. In 1968, the normal upper age for members of the Scout section was reduced from 17 to 14 and the Venturer section was created for ages 14 to 17. As part of these changes, Queen's Scout rank was replaced with the Queen's Venturer Award. The Amory Adventure Award is awarded to the Venturer Company that exhibits the most initiative in conceiving, planning, and executing an outdoor adventure. The Medal of the Maple was created in 2007 and is awarded for distinguished youth service and excellence within the scouting movement. Camps Scouts Canada operates over 125 camps across Canada. Popular camps include Camp Ampiza, Halliburton Scout Reserve, Camp Bing and Tamarakuta Scout Reserve. The Tamarakuta Scout Reserve is among the oldest continually operating scout camps in the world. A small number of camps are designated scenes centers which are properties that are operated and managed according to the highest environmental standards and are committed to protecting ecosystems and minimizing their environmental impact. They also provide hands-on educational activities for youth and training opportunities for leaders, enabling all to engage with nature and become empowered to make their own personal commitment to the environment. Major Events Canadian Scout Jamboree The Canadian Scout Jamboree or CJ is a jamboree run by Scouts Canada for members of the Scout and Venturer sections. The Jamboree will usually have several groups from other countries attending, most notable from the United States. The CJ that would normally have been held in 2005 was cancelled shortly after CJ-01 due to concerns about volunteer burnout. In 2004, CJ-07 was announced. CJ-07 was the first CJ held at a scout camp, 1949. First Canadian Scout Jamboree, Connaught Ranges, Ottawa, Ontario, 2,579 attend, 1953. Second Canadian Scout Jamboree, Connaught Ranges, Ottawa, Ontario, 1,196 attend, 1961. Third Canadian Scout Jamboree, Connaught Ranges, Ottawa, Ontario, 2095 attend, 1977. Fourth Canadian Scout Jamboree, Cabot Beach Provincial Park, Prince Edward Island, 16,000 attend, 1981. Fifth Canadian Scout Jamboree, Kanana Skis, Alberta, 19,000 attend, 1985. 6th Canadian Scout Jamboree, Guelph Lake Conservation Area, Guelph, Ontario, 12,000 attend, 1989. 7th Canadian Scout Jamboree, Port Lajoy, Fort Amherst, Prince Edward Island, 10,000 attend, 1993. 8th Canadian Scout Jamboree, Kanana Skis, Alberta, 12,000 attend, 1997. 9th Canadian Scout Jamboree, Boulevard Lake Park, Thunder Bay, Ontario, 13,879 attend, 2001. 10th Canadian Scout Jamboree, Cabot Beach Provincial Park, Prince Edward Island, 14,000 attend, 2007. 11th Canadian Scout Jamboree, Tamarakuta Scout Reserve, Quebec, 7,000 attend, 2013.
12th Canadian Scout Jamboree, Camp Woods, Sylvan Lake, Alberta, 2017. 13th Canadian Scout Jamboree, Camp Nedouai, Nova Scotia. Adventure Adventure is run by Scouts Canada for members of the Ventura Scout section. Created to further differentiate Scouts and Venturers, Adventure provides a different style of national camp for an older age group. 2012, First Venturer Adventure, Halliburton Scout Reserve, Halliburton, Ontario. 2014, Second Venturer Adventure, Camp Nor, Wes, Newfoundland. 2016, Third Venturer Adventure, Olympic Park, Whistler, British Columbia. World Jamborees hosted by Scouts Canada 8th World Scout Jamboree, 1955, Niagara on the Lake, Ontario. First World Jamboree held outside of Europe. 15th World Scout Jamboree, 1983, Kananaskis, Alberta. 24th World Scout Jamboree, 2019, the Summit Bechtel Family National Scout Reserve in Glen John, West Virginia. Scouts Canada will co-host along with the Association de Scouts de Mexico and the Boy Scouts of America. Canadian Moots Moots are for Rover Scouts. First Canadian Rover Moot. 1951, Blue Springs, Ontario 538 attend, 2nd Canadian Rover Moot, 1956 Sussex, New Brunswick, 3rd Canadian Rover Moot, 1959 Banff, Alberta, 4th Canadian Rover Moot, 1962 Mackinac, Quebec around 1000 attend, 5th Canadian Rover Moot, 1966 Parksville, British Columbia, 6th Canadian Rover Moot, 1970, Birds Hill Park, Winnipeg, Manitoba, 7th Canadian Rover Moot, 1974, Camp Samach, Oshawa, Ontario, 8th Canadian Rover Moot, 1978, Camp Ampiza, Pincher Creek, Alberta, 9th Canadian Rover Moot, 1982, Camp Wetar Skiween, St. Catharines, Ontario 531 attend, 10th Canadian Rover Moot, 1986, McLean Park, Langley, British Columbia, World Scout Moots hosted by Association des Scouts du Canada 14th World Scout Moot, 2013, Awakamund Mino Camp, Quebec, National Youth Network. The National Youth Network consists of Scouts Canada youth from across the country, consisting of each Council Youth Commissioner, three Assistant National Youth Commissioners and chaired by the National Youth Commissioner. Projects develop and promote flex, fast and focus, Scouts Canada's youth leadership training programs for Cub Scouts. Scouts and Ventura Scouts and maintain and adjudicate the Medal of the Maple for Distinguished Youth Service. The National Youth Network is only a small part of the larger Scouts Canada Youth Network that is made up of the National Youth Network, the Council Youth Networks, the Area Youth Networks and other youth representatives across Canada. Initiatives Scouts Canada has begun a process with the goal of doubling its membership by 2014. This process includes more direct program support to leaders, building on such things as a partnership with the Robert Bateman Foundation, a program helpline, an award-winning climate change program and a variety of camping programs across the country. Good Turn Week Good Turn Week is an initiative spearheaded by Scouts Canada National Youth Network that follows the principles of scouting, which teach youth to always do unto others as they would do unto you. The campaign is designed to encourage Canadians to do good turns for each other. In addition to the original initiative, the Good Turn Week Community Project Challenge was created to help sections, groups, or councils get their good turn ideas off the ground. Scouts Canada selected up to 15 projects nationally that would be funded up to $2,000 per project. 
2011 uniform redesign as part of this plan. Scouts Canada redesigned its uniforms with models designed by Joe Fresh Style. Beavers uniforms change only in color and fabric, while the major changes in the uniform design are seen in the changes to the style of the button-up shirt and its color from khaki to gray, green blue, or red, for Cubs, Scouts, Venturers, Rovers, Leaders respectively. It also offers a technical t-shirt for moisture management. As part of the redesign the sash was eliminated as a uniform component. The new design received high marks from fashion magazine Flair stating that the new uniforms are both stylish and comfortable controversies. Organizational structure Scouts Canada is governed, like all incorporated non-profit organization by a board of governors. Each council elects three voting members of whom at least one must be a youth. All members are able to vote for and all be nominees for council voting members. At the National Annual General Meeting of Members, voting members elect the Board of Governors and the National Commissioner. There are scouters, most notably members of an organization called Scout A, who believe there is a lack of representation and lack of accountability of this governance structure. Child Protection In 2012, the CBC ran a documentary suggesting that Scouts Canada had not always reported leaders who had sexually abused children to the police. Relating to incidents that took place between 1960 and 1990, Scouts Canada subsequently posted a video apology followed by a thorough arm's-length review of all records held by Scouts Canada on leader suspensions or terminations that are related to abuse by KPMG's Forensic Investigations Unit. The report from KPMG subsequently found no systemic intent to cover up or hide incidents of abuse youth protection in the late 1990s. Scouts Canada modernized its screening practices for adult members. Applicants must complete a police record check with vulnerable sector check. As well, local volunteers interview applicants and check the multiple references they must provide. Scouts Canada volunteers are prohibited from being with a youth member alone. Two fully screened volunteers are required to be present at all times. In the event that volunteers are suspected of misconduct, policy requires that they are immediately suspended and the relevant authorities are notified with all information shared. Scouts Canada provides with some of its handbooks and online a booklet called How to Protect Your Children from Child Abuse, a parent's guide. In addition, it is a badge requirement in the Scout program for parents and youth to review a portion of How to Protect Your Children from Child Abuse. A parent's guide relations with other Scout associations in 1999. The Baden-Powell Service Association Federation of Canada was ordered by Industry Canada to take the word Scout out of its title. Scouts Canada also sought for the removal of the name Baden-Powell. Going on to say, there's one scouting association in Canada, one in the world. Every country has only one. That's how Baden-Powell set up scouting, because Baden-Powell felt anything else would dilute the program cause confusion and hurt the programs for young people. The World Organization of the Scouting Movement website reinforces this policy which states, there can only be one national scout organizations per country councils. Scouts Canada has 20 geographical councils spread out across the nation. Each council is also divided into six service areas with Alberta having two operating offices, which contain a number of groups.